Welcome vampires to the official Zap hosting YouTube channel, my name is Ellie and today we'll show you how you can get your own vRising server in just a minute, so let's get started. First as always, visit our website zap-hosting.com and login into your Zap account. If you don't have an account yet, you can register here for free. Now navigate to the game servers tab and click on vRising, then click on the green start button. Here you can configure your own server to your liking, like server location, RAM, CPU, slots, and also IVP4 is important if you want to protect your server from incoming DDoS attacks. Finally, select a payment method and confirm your order. But before you do that, here is a little gift from us. 50% of voucher code, which you can use by clicking here on use voucher and typing rising minus 50. After you confirm your order, the server will be up in just a minute. Now open your server in our web interface by clicking on show product and wait for the server files to finish downloading. After your server files fully finish downloading, navigate to the settings tab which can be found right here on the left. Here feel free to edit the name of your server, protect it with a password or change any other settings. Once you configure everything to your liking, click on save and make sure to restart your server after the changes. Now launch vRising on your PC. Click on play, then online play. Here find the tab called find servers and click on it. Now click on display all servers and settings. You can now search for your server in the search box which can be found in the upper left. Now click on your server and type the password if you created one earlier and click on join game. As you can see you have now successfully connected to your own vRising server. If you don't see your server in the list you can also connect by clicking right here on direct connect and pasting your server IP. Just navigate back to your zap interface, copy your server IP Go back into the game and paste the server IP right here and click on connect. It will also ask you for the password if you have created one earlier. That's it for today. If you have any more questions, you can contact our support by creating a ticket on our website or live chat and they will be more than happy to help you out. Now have a lovely rest of the week and enjoy playing on your new Zap server.